I'm here at Birmingham University where the Brat Club athletes are hard at work. This is a field of Olympic dreams with a difference. Backwards walking, that's got to be a joke. I agree, on the, on the sound of it, you'd think, no, you can't be right. But actually, if you think about it, rowing, recognised Olympic event, you go backwards in the boat, swimming, there's the backstroke, and then, of course, you've got uh, in the high jump, which is an athletic event, you go backwards over the bar. So, as daft as it may sound, it's actually, it, it's not all that far-fetched. Better, better. Keep it tall, keep it long. Two weeks ago, you were competing at the NIA, at the International Indoor Walking Races. Prince, you came third. How did you feel about your performance? It was all right. I mean, I tried my best, but I'm quite sad about the time, but I'm sure it was a good, good race. Because you were just outside the Olympic qualifying time. Yeah. Do, you think, do you think you could make that? Yeah, surely. A bit more training. going to treat twice as hard. And yeah, I'll be back there again. And John, you just picked Prince and kept to come second, but also just outside that Olympic yeah. qualifying time. How do you feel about that? Um, I was happy to come second, but I was a bit disappointed, hopefully. Um, I'll be able to get the time in time for the Olympics. It's a difficult thing to get your head around because you can't see where you're going. So you're having to use the lines that are on the track all the time, which is why it's only going to be over 100 metres. They don't go around the bends, of course, because it's just dangerous. Well, last year I was walking backwards in a race and just went over on it and... You know, it's one of them events where you're not looking where you're going, so a lot of people fall over doing the event. As we've heard from Eden earlier on, you know, he's, he's injured and he, he had a real chance. He was top, uh, top 10 in Europe last year. John and Prince, they're coming up on the rails. They're coming up on the rails pretty fast and you never know. It's one of those events that you can fall over very easily on the day. It's a bit of a lottery. Anybody could win it. So, yeah, fingers crossed. But, I mean, for these guys, wow, what a fantastic opportunity for them.